I'm Simon Pegg. And I'm Nick Frost. You might have seen our other collaborations with WizKid director Edgar Wright, Shaun of the Dead and Hot Fuzz. Now check out our new film, The World's End. Coming soon to theatres everywhere. And we're back. Just like the five musketeers. Three musketeers, isn't it? Well, nobody knows how many there were, really, do they? You know that the three musketeers is a fiction, right? Written by Alexander Dumas. A lot of people are saying that about the Bible these days. What, that it was written by Alexander Dumas? Oh, don't be daft, Steve. It was written by Jesus. Are we there, yeah? Let's do this! The World's End is about five friends who recreate a pub crawl that they attempted when they were 19. But they never really finished. This is our chance to finally conquer the Golden Mile. 12 pubs, 12 pints. Terminating in the World's End. What do you recommend? Beer. We'll have five of those, please. Four of those and a tap water. What? The central theme of the film is your hometown is not what it used to be. Look who it is. Wow, long time. Gary. Will Common, bienvenue. Welcome. Well, it's weird, isn't it? You come back and everything's sort of different. Is that because you've got older or has something else happened? I suggest you get on your way. Welcome home, boys. <laughs> it's not us that's changed, it's the town. What are you doing? It's all right, I'm not trying to have sex with you. There's something I need to tell you right now. Unless you do want to have sex, in which case I'll tell you afterwards. Tell me right now. What, what did he say, sir? Newton Haven has been taken over by robots. Did you believe him? Where are the others? They're blending in. Hello, I am a robot. 291, take one. When we did Hot Fuzz, it wasn't a sequel to Shaun of the Dead. When we started writing The World's End, we thought, well, actually, maybe we can make this a trilogy. This springs together, Shaun of the Dead and Hot Fuzz. It's about the individual versus the collective, whether it be zombies or the NWA. So it's a fitting conclusion to those three films. What the hell is that? Ah! Most of the actors had to do some serious fight training. The fight scenes are just extraordinary. They make us look like little Jackie Chan. So I kind of self-coined myself the Pink Hulk, <laughs> where I have the stools for fists. <gasps> I would imagine getting hit by Nick Frost and a stool would be <laughs> quite painful. The stunt men seem to enjoy it more the harder you hit them. I uh, kind of enjoyed it. <laughs> We had this idea that everybody who's in the first two has to be in this film. We were very keen that we keep the same team. It's like family. When you're acting next to Martin or Paddy or Simon or Eddie, you have to up your game. The five of us have an absolute blast on set. We just laugh all the time. <laughs> There's lots and lots of subtlety in this, as well as outright silliness. We head back to London. A, we're all drunk. B, we've got blood on our hands. It's more like ink. We've got ink on our hands. It's immediately funny. It has a great rhythm to it. Let's climb down the drain pipe. i got a better idea. Climb down the drain pipe. <laughs> this August, the only way they'll survive the night <laughs> is to make it all the way <laughs> to the world's end. We are going to get to the world's end if it kills us. Oh, no.